TikTok, Instagram, and even YouTube are all key players in the short form content space. Short form content became so popular because it helps communicate to those with shorter attention spans, hence why it got so popular on social media. Not only is it way quicker and less complicated to produce than long form content, but it's also much easier to create and consume than any other form of content. And you can do either of those with just your phone. That said, all of my short form content was actually filmed with my camera, even vertically. Now to set up the sequence in Premiere Pro for your vertical footage, start by clicking new item, sequence, go up to settings, choose your frame rate, then set your frame size to 1080 horizontal by 1920 vertical. This will allow you to have a nine by 16 aspect ratio, which is the correct size for TikTok, IG reels and YouTube shorts. You can leave the rest as the default options. And if you don't wanna do this every time, you can save the preset by clicking save preset and then naming the preset. You'll then find it under custom. Once you have your edited vertical video on your timeline, we can export it by going into File, Export, Media. In the export settings, my format is set to H.264 and my preset is set to Match Source High Bit Rate. Next, you can name the vertical video by selecting the output name and you can choose where you want it to export to as well. Now go to your video tab and make sure that your basic video settings display a width of 1080 and a height of 1920. If for any reason it has a different aspect ratio, you can untick this box to change the values. Make sure your frame rate is correct and then leave field order and aspect as their default options. Then make sure render at maximum depth is ticked, then scroll down to bitrate encoding and have it set to VBR2 pass and set both the sliders to 8. Now that the video settings are done, you can check use maximum render quality. Before going into the audio settings, make sure that AAC is selected, the sample rate is 48,000 Hz and the channels are set to stereo. Audio quality is set to high and bitrate settings is 320. And for the final settings you need to change, click on the effects tab and scroll all the way down until you see loudness normalization. Once it's selected, change the loudness standard to ITU BS. Target loudness to negative 14, the tolerance to zero, and the max true peak level to negative one. The reason why you're changing this is that it's going to limit the loudness of your audio so that it doesn't peak. Peaking audio sounds horrible, and these loudness normalization tweaks will save your short form content's audio. Next, all you need to do is click export, and then you can upload your vertical video to YouTube Shorts, TikTok, or IG Reels directly from your phone. Thanks for watching, liking, and subscribing, guys. If you'd like to learn more Premiere Pro tips and tricks, continue on to the playlist on the screen now.